Hello, everybody. Welcome to the class tonight. We're going to talk about is your home poisoning you? <laughs> Isn't that fun? <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice if we didn't have to talk about that? Wouldn't it be nice if we didn't live in a world where we uh, go to a grocery store and we buy things in good faith thinking they're safe for us and then we get home and we start to research and we look at the things on the, the ingredients on the label and we realize, uh-oh, we're being poisoned. What about the water that we drink? What about um, just the things that are in, on, and around us? Things we put on uh, lotion and things to, that we put on our skin just to kind of get by. Things that we have to have, right? Things that we put on our babies. We're going to talk about that tonight in a light way, not in the down in the weeds way, which we talk about with all the science, but we're just going to kind of touch on it so that you will understand and get it, get it like intro to what's actually in your home. Okay. So I'm going to share my screen and uh, Sherry, I want you to just introduce yourself. Thanks for, how are you? Thanks for uh, coming on tonight and sharing with us and just talk about how you've replaced some things in your home. You don't have to get it. We're going to go through the details of the ditch and switch, but just like what got you started um, to look at the things in your home, kind of on your journey with uh, your, your illness that made you stop and take a second look at things you're putting in your home. Hi, honey. Hi. Uh, well, I'm uh, happy to be on your class tonight. Um, I am a uh, breast cancer overcomer and <laughs> I battled it all through 2017. And after I was introduced to doTERRA, the first thing I did was work on getting my body clean and detox and healthy. And then the very next step, which would be the natural thing is to look at what is in my home, what uh, could have been contributing to um, the C word attacking my body. And uh, it, at first it seemed a little bit overwhelming, but uh, I learned from you one, one thing at a time, one thing at a time. And so that's what I did. I just concentrated on one thing in the house at a time and then went to the next thing and the next thing. So it's not hard to do. No, it's a transition. It's an easy transition um, because we love to shop. It's part of what we do as women. We're usually the shopper for the home and um, you know, not always, but usually. And, um, of course I let my husband do grocery shopping if he wants to, <laughs> I like to do all the other shopping, but anyway, um, yeah, so it's natural for us to transition and get to try some new things and just transition as we need new things. But let's start at the beginning. I'm going to share my screen, um, Sherry, and we're going to go through some of these slides just to kind of give us, um, a good parameter of like, you know, uh, talking points because there's so much, we could talk about here and we're literally going to hit the highlights. Um, we, for our customers, once you join us, we have some amazing education. And in our education, we have a deep dive into toxins and how to detoxify your home. We're just going to kind of show you some easy switches that you can make tonight and just give you a few little details. So this is not going to be a long class, going to be a short class but we're just going to um, give you some great information. And if you want further help, you can contact Sherry or I, or who, Sherry, myself, or the person who invited you to this class. And um, we can plug you in to teach you more. And we're going to even tell you at the end how you can get something to just get started if you'd like. So here we go. This is Essential Oils Made Easy. We just kind of, we just kind of uh, are adding a little bit to it. So tonight we're talking about, is your home poisoning you? Because I want to tell you, it very well could be. Unless you have opted out on purpose with purpose, the answer to this is yes. And, you know, it's amazing. I'm going to ask you a question, Sherry. When you're going through cancer and your cancer treatment, which it's been how long now? 2017, 18, since you've been through that, right? <laughs> so since you've been through that, um, while you were going through that, did your doctors ever tell you to go through your home and look at toxins? I, I don't know the answer to this question. Not once. Not once. Wow. Okay. So there are some known carcinogenics that we're going to talk about in here. That carcinogenic means it causes cancer, but what we're going to, the goal of this class is just to empower you. We're going to tell you quickly three things about essential oils. Why? Because essential oils are a great replacement for some of the things we're going to be talking about. We're going to quickly go over 
the way um, they work, how to use them, how to get oils in your home if you're ready to make this transition. You know, on my post, Sherry, you've seen this. I kind of ask this question all the time. Are you ready for natural solutions yet? <laughs> and I hope that no one waits. You know, I'll take people wherever they're at in their walk, but let's not wait till we get cancer till we have to look, step back and look at this. And, you know, Sherry, I've been on, a, I've really upped my health game uh, it, it, it has been a, a transition, a slow transition for me. I didn't do everything at once. And literally this year, and honestly, you bet were a true inspiration for this. I decided all the things that throughout my life that I've seen that um, people do when they get cancer, like they get a juicer and they start juicing and they, you know, they do some things differently. I decided I'm going to be proactive in my life. I bought myself a juicer. I even started watching like what kind of coffee, making sure I don't have coffee that has mold in it or in carcinogenic, carcinogenic um, attributes. I mean, I'm like, I really felt convicted of the Lord because I feel like, you know, the Lord meets you where you are. And when you know better, you do better. And that the Lord is like, you know, like I know a lot. So to whom much is given, and I, I don't know everything because I'm a forever student. I learn every day, but to who, who much is given, much is required. So I've really stepped up my game, even January 22, like I have, or anything that you've done, Sherry, like in January to kind of like step it up again. Oh, absolutely. You know, um, I'm learning every day and I'm, and you're the best teacher, by the way, but, I'm, and she, she did not ask for that. No. But <laughs> I, you know, I actually thought that I had learned a lot through my journey. I, I did the same thing. I, I got a juicer, uh, but, um, you know, there was so much more to learn. There's so much. And today I was even thinking about all the people and all the friends that I know who are sick right now with different things you know that are out there and and I actually and you know there's no shame in this but I do see a lot of people post that hey I'm sick I'm sick I'm sick I'm sick and I just wanted to say you know when are we going to learn when are we going to change what we're doing or when, when are we going to look around what's in our houses or what we're putting in our bodies there are people that on my that are friends of mine that post over and over about their sickness and about the things they're going through in their house. And I've reached out to some of them like, Hey, you know, I would love to help you. I'll send you stuff for free. I will send you samples, you know, and because I guess they think I'm trying to sell them something, you know, it's really difficult guys. Cause I reach out in love. If I do, I like, honestly, I hate doing that, but it's so frustrating for us who have an answer, things that we know how to boost our immune system. When we see people post all these home remedies, um, I saw somebody today post um, that somebody in their home was sick or their family was sick and they literally made them a package, a care package with Cheetos and Sprite and a big thing of a can of Campbell's chicken noodle soup and like, oh, I'm taking this over. You guys, look, I, I know I used to be there and, and like lifesavers and uh, cough, the cough drops that are like candy. I'm like, oh my gosh, please yes. let me help you. For what you spent on that goodie bag, I could literally have set you up with a, a package of things that are like natural antibiotics. And Jane, I, can I, let me just say something I learned, uh, you know, all that's, I mean, I'm sure their intentions are good, yes. but those are immune suppressors, mm -hmm. immune suppressors. And I didn't know that before. Yeah. There's actually a, a, a chemical in um, Cheetos and goldfish and that is a, it, that is highly carcinogenic that causes cancer y'all. Um, so, you know, I, I, I should probably do a class on it, but uh, I've mentioned it to one of my friends who's addicted to one of those, I'm not going to say what, but one of those things. And she's like, I don't, don't tell me, I don't want to know. You guys, we have to do better. We have to do better. Okay. Um, because the information is out there. 
And it is our responsibility as the, our bodies are a temple of the Holy Spirit. And the Bible tells us that what know ye not, you are the temple of the Holy Ghost. You have been bought with a price. You are not your own. So let me just start with preaching. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's talk about oils. Sherry, what do you think about that as we get started here? What do I think about the, the oils? The responsibility, just like the, oh, what do you listen, think about? We are responsible for our own health. You know, I, we can't blame, we can't blame it on this or that, or this is how I was brought up. This is my background. Mm -hmm. uh, there is so much information now that we, we, we have no excuse to know better and to do better. And, uh, you know, now I have, I have two grandchildren, a one-year-old and a two-year-old back to back. And now it's like way more. I think, I wish I knew in my twenties and thirties, what I know now, because I want to be around a long time to play with them and to go to their t-ball games and their high school games and their college games. Mm -hmm. And so now when I'm wanting, when I, my body or my mind thinks that I need some junk food, I don't let my flesh be the boss of me anymore. That's right. That's right. And you know what? I just heard this most amazing quote. I don't know if it gets this right. Choose your pain, the pain of discipline or the pain of regret. The pain of discipline brings about joy because it brings you success. It might be a temporary pain, but once you get into that realm of discipline and you, because what is the root word of disciple, right? Or the root word of discipline is disciple. We are called to be disciples, imitators of Christ. And we've, if you cannot be a disciple without discipline, you cannot be a, a, an example to others, especially in this day where health is everything. Like our health literally is separating the, the sheep from the goats. <laughs> and it's, and it's, I'm, that's not funny because, um, we're being separated in our health because some are going to survive and some are not because these things that are coming down the pike are not going to stop. They're not going to stop. And we just, I, I'm building my immune system every single day and um, I'm confident and I'm not afraid. And I don't have fear because I'm, I'm disciplined in my health and my uh, working out and um, supporting my body to heal and giving my body every single thing it needs to thrive in this world. So we're going to tell you why uh, essential oils. So all of that to say <laughs> three cool things about essential oils. We're going to quickly go through them. And the first cool thing about essential oils is they're safe. Um, they're hundred percent natural and safe. They have no side effects, no addictions. They only have side benefits. And we'll talk about that. Uh, even peppermint that we show right here, you might use peppermint for head tension, but if you also have nausea, it'll relieve that at, at the same time or vice versa, right? It also cools your body. It promotes clear breathing and it energizes you. So if you wake up in the morning with like that dull ache in your head and you just have like a brain fog and you need to wake up, you can put it on and it'll relieve that head tension. It'll energize you and give you energy, energy right away. And one drop of peppermint oil is equivalent to 28 cups of peppermint tea. So think about how energizing it would be, but difficult to drink 28 cups of peppermint tea. One drop of peppermint essential oil, doTERRA oil is equivalent to all that. They're 70 times, 50 to 70 times more powerful than herbs, tinctures, tea, or any other form of plant medicine is the most powerful form of a plant you can have to go back to heal your body. And we're going to tell you why these are perfectly uh, safe and um, some of our oils are pharmaceutical grade all of them will be as we go through the process doTERRA is the only company that has therapeutic grade essential oils secondly Siri tell us how they're effective well they're effective because plant cells are the closest thing to human cells so the, the oils can go straight in to our cells, whereas medication can only work from the outside of the cells. And um, the, within just a few minutes, I think it's just like a couple of minutes, they're already in your bloodstream. And when, within like 20 minutes, they're through your whole body. Yeah. 
That's right. And so we have this oil called On Guard that you can diffuse while you're asleep and uh, you can put it on. You can use it all three ways. We're going to tell you about that in a second, um, but it promotes healthy it, immune function. And it is just a blend of some essential oils, um, rosemary, um, cinnamon. I mean, uh, things that well, those are things you'd use in your kitchen, right? But in the oil form, they're so powerful. Orange is in there. And this helps to support your immune function. It soothes your sore throat. Um, you can drink it in some honey or some tea. We, it's in all our cleaning products. We're going to talk about how we place all our cleaners, um, our toothpaste, all the things, this on guard. When you, in the, in the cleaner, when you clean something with on guard, um, it can't grow bacteria or viruses for seven days. It's proved, proven to be more effective and stronger than Lysol or um, bleach even. So this is an amazing uh, oil and it's so beneficial to us and it's healing to our bodies, not um, poison like the things I mentioned before. So they are, the second cool thing about essential oils is they are so effective, more effective than modern approaches because of the ability of that oil, just like Sherry said, to penetrate and permeate the cell wall. The third cool thing, Sherry, tell us what's cool about the third cool thing about essential oils. Is they are very, very affordable. Now I've had a lot of people say, oh, I can't afford that. But when you really break it, break it down, it's pennies, just pennies per dose. Yeah. Literally, you will save hundreds of dollars in medical costs and in co-pays and um, deductibles and, and things like that. Because we get healthy with the oils because they're from plants, they're from, from nature, but we're staying healthy. <laughs> Yes. For saying nothing. You know, I was just thinking uh, today, I just, I mean, it's, it's amazing. Listen, I used to go to the doctor for every part of the body, <laughs> a doctor for every part. <laughs> and it's just like, now I'm like, you know, they're probably missing me <laughs> because they haven't <laughs> seen me. <laughs> yeah. So it is, there's a st statistic that says that Four out of the five things that we would miss work or school for in our home, we can address with natural solutions. Another, another statistic says that 85% of the things that you would normally have to go to the ER or the doctor for a doctor visit, 85% um, of those things you can address with natural solutions when you're properly educated. And listen, we give you all the education. All you have to do is get the products Sherry, do we educate you around here? Listen, we educate. We are continually doing continuing education. We are, listen, it's a plethora of information that our team, uh, doTERRA alone has a plethora of information, but our team alone is rich in information. We will make sure you will not be equipped. Yeah. And it's, if you're not, it's, it's on you. Cause we would literally pour it out and have it. So, so many different platforms where you can get the education that we provide in it is all free. So um, here we're talking about affordability, lavender, it's calming for the mind. It's calming for the skin, but this oil alone has hundreds of uses. A bottle of lavender is what, I don't know. How much is it like $20? I don't know. It's, it's, it's low. Yeah. Yeah. So it's about, but you guys, there's 250 drops in there and you can use it for everything from head tension, seasonal. Um, I started to say the word seasonal threats <laughs> when the seasons change, um, bug bites, zits, <laughs> anything that itches or red or anything that's angry on your skin, that's red and, and itchy or including a mood that's angry, right? It helps to calm you down. It helps you to sleep. Um, let me tell you something. If you can buy something that has a, that for about 20 bucks that has 250 drops of something that's going to help your kids sleep. And uh, if you have a baby, uh, put use it for make your own diaper rash um, stuff that doesn't have any side effects. Look, it's worth its weight in gold. I have used the lavender, my little one, my little grandson, he got stung by a bee here at my house on my deck and we put the lavender on him, cured it just like that. And, and as a matter of fact, just the other day, I burnt myself cooking and then, and my husband, oh, he jumped up, you know, cause he thought I was bad hurt. 
I said, get the lavender. He ran and got it. And I'm telling you the next day, it was just totally gone. Yeah. I mean, this stuff, and when you have it in your house and you have something and you, you, almost can't remember what it was like when you, when you would get a burn. I got a, I did the same thing, um, boiling some eggs, it, the colander spilled over on my thumb and I immediately got blisters with boiling water on my thumb and man, what would I have done? You know, you would just be in suffering pain and the bug bite situation that alone, I'm telling you, it's awesome. And it, there repels bugs too. So many things. Uh, we just, get excited about this stuff you guys because when you when you have it you you just want everybody to have it because it's such a, a game changer and here are some ways to use essential oils these are our favorite ways to use them you want to talk about the first one sherry okay the first way to use essential oils is aromatic and so what we do is we put just a few drops and some water in a diffuser and we you can I diffuse. I have when I started out, I had one diffuser. <laughs> now, now I have one in every room and in the car. I will not travel without that diffuser in my car. And um, so, you know, it diffuses. Uh, it's it's not like not like candles or anything like that because I've had people say, "Well, smells bother me." No, no, this this will not. This will not because this is natural. And it sometimes I just sometimes I just want to lift my mood. So there are certain oils that I'll use just to, Hey, you know, like it's, it gets dark so early The you know, that, that can bring depression and things like that. So I diffuse some oils to lift my spirits. There's times that I put different oils because of seasonal threats and I want that protection, you know, in my house, or I want to purify or I, or I want to use oils that help me sleep. So they're, they're just, the possibilities are endless, but like, it's like now that is one way that you can actually, you're actually helping your health when you yeah. do this. It's not just for the sense. No, it, it's for your health. Absolutely. For the health of it. Yeah. So, and you can do it while you're sleeping. So anything you can do while you're sleeping, I'm such a multitasker. I like to be doing multiple things at a time. <laughs> I'm always listening to something when I'm working, trying to feed my spirit, my worship. I like to, I'm doing a hundred things at once, right? When I'm working out, trying to worship music to work my workout. Um, so this is what anything I can do while I'm sleeping. Oh my gosh, that's a plus. So you can boost your immunity with that on guard oil. And, and then also, uh, you know, boost your immune system do, and help balance your hormones while you're sleeping and then also support your good sleep. So, I mean, what else can you do while you're sleeping? I mean, it's amazing. Uh, let's talk about the second cool way. And that is topically, and I'm trying to get this up here. Yeah. Topically. So, um, I just had some, while you were talking, you just reminded me, I got out my neroli it's orange blossom oil. And, you know, we, I do have the winter blues all the time in the winter. So this is one that really helps lift my mood. When you smell those orange blossoms that come from uh, Egypt, I believe. I mean, it just lifts, it's like sunshine in a bottle. Yeah. Um, so they have localized benefits, emotional benefits, but also like if you, again, we talked about a bug bite, a wound or anything you do it, you can topically do it where uh, localized benefits. So if you have a back pain, you can take your uh, capiba stick and put it where it hurts. Uh, you know, just it's common sense. This is common sense. It's so instinctual. Just a couple drops are usually a dose. Just, uh, you know, rub some on topically and uh, on your affected areas. So it's amazing. Yeah. I mean, what do you like to use topically, Sherry? <laughs> Well, I have, let's, let's just, let's just try to make this quick. So I get, <laughs> I get up in the morning and, um, well, one of the first things I do is put a drop of frankincense under my tongue, but, um, I have a thyroid, uh, roller blend that I use on my thyroid. Mm -hmm. And then I use Clary Calm on both my wrist and my brain stem, um, sometimes on my temples and, um, Oh, I have been doing something else too. I've, I've, <laughs> I, uh, you may think I'm crazy, but I have been taking slim and sassy and, I, and I wrap it in on some fat deposits because it, it, it can break down something. Yes. 
fascia. Yeah. It breaks down the fascia and helps you with trouble spots and you can make a roller or you can um, put it in um, one of the pump uh, dispensers. And um, actually I need to make that for myself and I'm out of my hair growth. My hair stopped, uh, started falling out after COVID. Like I think everybody's and I made myself, um, a, um, my recipe, which is on YouTube for hair growth. And I put it on topically massage it in my hair two or three times a day. Cause when I'm home and I just wear a hat or wear my hair up. Um, so that's why I have my hair up a lot now, but my hair has grown so much. Literally the top layer of my hair is like down the top where it's, I've always have it cut short in the top for height. It's like down to here. So the longest part of my hair is up here because <laughs> I cut this short because I didn't want it to be all long and straggly. So it's longer up here. And I'm just, I'm like, I'm just going to wear it up this winter. I'm not hardly going anywhere anyway. And I'm going to see how long I can get my hair. And it totally stopped falling out after about, um, I'd say two weeks, maybe a week after I started using that. I mean, this, the fallout stopped and then a couple more weeks, it just kind of was at a standstill. And then after about a month, man, the it's like that little doll that you used to pull the hair out <laughs> or top of her head. <laughs> That's what I feel like. So anyway, yeah, topically, so many ways to use it topically. Thirdly, our favorite way to use essential oils because it's crazy game changer is internally. Um, we can drink it in our water. That's why we're addicted to drinking water because our water tastes so good. And like I knew Sherry would have hers. And so I'm drinking grapefruit today. Um, and so uh, in my water, just a couple drops and a big thing like that. Sherry, what are you drinking today? Lemon. Yeah, because we're on the cleanse. And um, you could also make a veggie cap, um, which doTERRA sells this big bottle of veggie caps for $4. And um, you just take an empty one. And I'll show it to you here. Um, they're just clear and you break it open and you just drip the oils right into the capsule and you can blend it with um, a series of oils or one oil and um, for whatever you need it for. So whether you're trying to balance your blood pressure or balance your mood or balance your hormones or whatever it is that you're trying to balance or um, support, uh, you can make your own veg veggie cap and you are so empowered to take your health in your hands. Right, Sherry? Yeah. So when I first uh, saw that you all did that, I thought, oh my gosh, that's so crazy. But now it's like, I, you, when, once you start, when, once you learn how to do it, it's nothing. It's nothing. I might not have done it perfect the first couple of times, might have ruined a few capsules, but now it's like, like that's a staple in our home. Yeah. If, and, and if something comes our way and does try to attack our bodies, we, we've got the capsules, we make the capsules. My, it's like, once I learned, my family wanted to learn. They're like, I want to be better too, <laughs> you know? Right. And it's so empowering to know that you have these um, tools in your toolbox to help support your health. It is an, a total game changer. I know some people hate that word. It's overused, but I can't think of another word to better describe it. So let's talk about some of the things. Um, is your home slowly poisoning you? Okay. So we're going to talk about going on a toxin hunt to detox your home today. So if you have any things of these things, you're watching this video. And I'm going to, um, we're going to go through later, um, Sherry, and to talk about what we replace these with, but the artificially scented candles. Okay. Those are hormone disruptors. I just want to tell you a couple little secrets here. There's a store, uh, that's in every mall in America. Pretty, I'm pretty sure, um, that everybody knows about that sells all these lotions and candles and they have like, they'll have a whole section of la lovely lavender and sweet smelling orange or, you know, that whatever. Okay. Now, and people, I used to buy this stuff for my little daughter when she was from little tiny to teenage, uh, she would go in there. And when we would go in there, when they had their sales and their half off thing or whatever, and we would just buy, buy, buy. And she would just get the whole suite. Like she would get the lotion and the candle and the, 
um, the perfume and the body spray and the shampoo. I mean, she would get it all right. And, and I thought I was being such a good mom, just spoiling my little girl with all this stuff, right? Little did I know that people working there get hazard pay because they can only work there for so long that the toxins get to them and they can't even stand to work there. Uh, they make like almost double what some of the people in the other stores in the mall make because of the toxins that they have to endure by being in that store. These are hormone disruptors. They can cause reproductive issues, fertility issues. They can trigger allergies. They can cause headaches. Oh my gosh. They do. They cause headaches. I mean, you can walk, I can walk in that store. <laughs> as a person who don't get headaches and walk in there, if I had to stay in there five minutes, I would have a splitting headache. I, I could probably be in there one minute and, and I have to run out. Um, one of the reasons they always have their doors open if they're in a store that's um, open to the outside. And you always think like, why do they always have their doors open? It's freezing outside um, because they can't stand it in there. Okay. It also causes DNA damage and respiratory issues. The company that owns this company, there is a, a, a um, video on Netflix called Stink, if it's still on there. This is the same company that is being talked about in the video Stink. It is one of the most eye-opening videos. I watched it a few years ago and I was blown away. And this was talking about a store called Limited Two and the pajamas and the, the fragrance in the pajamas and the sleepwear is where this journey started, that this man started his journey to find out that in fragrance, anything in the United States that has fragrance in it, it does not have to name that ingredient. They can put any kind of toxins, poisons, flammable okay yeah our little girl pajamas that i was buying my little girls from limited two were flammable and poison okay so this is the same company all right so there and i live in the land of png there i live in the where where their headquarters are and they are one of the biggest offenders in fabric softeners in detergents um, the chemicals that they do not list in the category of fragrance does not have to be listed. In the United States, there are 11,000 banned substances in other countries that are allowed here. Okay, so in Europe, there are 11,000 banned substances that these companies use, and the FDA has a list out of these 11,000 of 11. 11 that they have banned okay the other 10,990 whatever 89 are allowed in the united states so the sensi things those little sensis that people sell oh they're all natural uh y'all artificial fragrances and they can cause all of the things below and some of these things are also carcinogenic lotions you put on your skin okay total horrible for you. All right. Most of them, because just the way essential oils get in your bloodstream and in two minutes, they're in your bloodstream in 20 minutes, they're in every cell of your body. Guess what's in there too. If you put on lotions with carcinogenics, anything you're putting in on or around you, it's getting into your bloodstream. Another offender, adulterated essential oils. I hear people sometimes say, well, I buy the cheap essential oils to diffuse. And then I save doTERRA oils for uh, when I'm sick. Okay, wait. <laughs> so you're going to use the stuff that makes you sick <laughs> in case you get sick. You can use the one. So yeah, again, um, 90, about 96% of essential oils are adulterated with unnatural synthetics. And um, I've even heard of essential oils starting fires in diffusers. Okay. When they're close to like a um, the ceiling. Uh, these are not doTERRA essential oils. These are oils that have flammable. Um, there is a competitor with uh, the main competitor competitor with doTERRA, which doTERRA left him in the dust a long time ago. Their oil um, that is com comparable to On Guard is called Thieves, and it has a flammable um, um, warning. And their frankincense has a flammable warning. Okay. Anything that says it's flammable. <laughs> 
don't use it, okay? Hairspray and beauty products, perfumes and colognes. Perfumes are a huge offender. Um, cleaning supplies, dryer sheets. If you know about dryer sheets, um, if you take your dryer um, screen and if you've used dryer sheets for a long time, you can put it under the faucet and the water will, will not penetrate that screen because of the coating of those dryer sheets. Those dryer sheets do the same thing to the human lungs. So no wonder we're susceptible to respiratory things when we're using the air fresheners, the plugins, the room sprays, the dryer sheets, our sheets are bathed in toxins that we sleep in every night. The soaps we use to clean ourselves. I had a friend who used to drive a truck when he was like in college. And he said, hey, if you knew, I used to drive a truck for the soap company around here. And he said, if you knew what they put in the soap, you would never put it on your body. It's disgusting. <laughs> This animal fat and duck fat and all this waste from the from the animal factories or whatever the slaughterhouses they use in the soap. So this is why I don't mind paying a little bit more for from so uh, for some DoTerra soap when I know it's organic, plant based, and just all things that are good for me. So let's talk about some ditching, some ditching and switching here. Okay, um, one of the ways that uh, doTERRA makes this easy to transition. So one of the things that we I talked to Sherry about when she was making this big transition was, you know, do one thing at a time. When you run out of your shampoo, then go put it in your doTERRA cart. And the way that you save money with doTERRA is we have something called loyalty rewards. And um, the first three months you're in it, you save 10% back and you get it back in points and all your 100% of your shipping back in points. Um, the next three months you get, it goes up to 15, then it goes up to 20. And then by the time you're at the end of the year, you get 30% back in points. Plus we get a free oil every month. Um, sometimes those are oils that you can't buy. They're really awesome ones from uh, exotic places in the world. And um, it's just amazing to um, get all the savings. And so if somebody thinks that doTERRA is expensive, it's because they're buying it either retail or they don't know about the awful, awesome ways we have to save money. What do you think about this, Sherry? About well, I love it. I love it. Yeah. yeah, I love uh, loyalty rewards. Um, that's one of the greatest things because doTERRA isn't a, isn't a company that just takes your money. They're giving money back to you. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, when I started out, I had just a few oils and I just thought, and I wanted everything. You know, when I started learning, I wanted it all. I wanted everything and I couldn't buy it all at once. But with the loyalty rewards program, I have been able to build my inventory of oils and supplements because I'm getting them free. I just put them in my cart. Uh, so I mean, think about that. You're getting 100% of the shipping back in points, Yeah. you know? So, um, I mean, I don't know any other company that does this plus gives you a free oil every month with the, when your order is at least 125 points. But yeah. now I have, I am so proud <laughs> of my oil inventory because I've been able to help my friends and help my family and help, help us to be healthy because I've been building this up and the loyalty rewards programs helps you when you can't afford to buy everything. Yeah, that's right. That's right. And they reward the loyal customers. So let's talk about the ditch and switch. Woohoo! So Sherry, tell me um, about your transition from deodorant. And I, I don't know any of the answers to these questions I'm asking you. So. <laughs> No, we had actually ever talked about that. I actually have tried two or three of their deodorants. And the good thing about this is because, listen, I, I battled breast cancer. And one of the main things that I learned is that when you get your deodorant at a store or whatever, it has like aluminum and things like that. And you're putting it in your armpit right next to your uh, lymph nodes, yeah. right next to your... Uh, you know, your breast, your breast tissue. And so I learned that, you know, that those others are not healthy for you. And doTERRA has <laughs> essential oils in them too. So they're not only 
keeping you fresh. They're healing you and not give, putting bad stuff into your body. That's right. Yeah. And then if you, if you know somebody that has pain, um, that use things like icy hot, um, we have something that's so much better. <laughs> it's, oh, yeah, called, yeah. it's called deep blue. And actually we've even upgraded it to this stick right now. And you put this on joint or muscle pain and it's amazing, um, what it can do for your body and how it helps instantly with relief. I wish they would sell that by the case. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right. We need a case of them. Uh-huh. Um, so shampoo and conditioner, um, another thing that uh, you're putting shampoo with full of toxins and carcinogenic, it's carcinogenic, car, carcinogens <laughs> right next to your brain. So it seeps right into there, uh, you know, gets right into your brain tissue. Um, but how about this? We have doTERRA shampoo and conditioner. We have beard oil. So for your hair care, we have all the things to replace all the toxic things that you would normally use. And it's good for all hair types. Also the skincare. Sherry, do you love the skincare? Oh my goodness. Listen, I want to tell you something. Now, th- th- this is something I'm embarrassed about, but I, I did clean out what I had because I am a skin, lotion, serum, anti-aging junkie. And my everybody gets that for me for Christmas and my birthday. My, my mom, she's always ordering, you know, off QVC and off this stuff. Listen, I'm not, I'm not making this up. I cleaned out a three, one of those big, giant garbage bags full of those things. And I have, I mean, I just thought, well, can this, can doTERRA's um, facial cleanser and mask be just as great as all? Oh my goodness. I'm in love with it. I'm in love with it. I could do commercials for it. Me too, because I tell you, I'm also a former junkie. I have, uh, I started managing um, out of college. I was a fashion major. So I was a manager for Saks Fifth Avenue. I did the first floor. I had cosmetics as one of my departments. So I've been able to get free skincare most of my adult life. And uh, when I tell you Clarins, Lemur, Chanel, Dior, I've always got that stuff for free. And that was not even good enough for me. There was a skincare company out of Japan where I had to go to Paris when I would go minister and save up my money to buy this special skincare that came from Japan. I have a really funny story about it. Uh, When I first started buying it, uh, I went into this shop at, on the Champs de Lisée in France uh, at Sephora, and my friend who went to the church where I ministered was manager, so I got a discount. And I was waiting for the lady to to uh, wait on me, and there were, she had these customers. Oh my gosh, some some of those beautiful women I've ever seen in person in my life. I they were they look they didn't even look real. They I know they were like models. And, um, so I said, excuse me, you know, I'd like some help in the sensei or whatever. She said, um, oh, she goes, you're new to the line. And I said, well, yes, I've used one or two of the products. And she, I said, how did you know? She goes, because my darling, you have wrinkles. (laughs) In other words, if you were using this, you, oh, thanks. And I mean, I was like 40. I mean, so I didn't really, I don't think I had a lot of wrinkles when I was 40. Anyway, um, yeah, so that's how snobby I was with my skincare. And I would save up for the whole year. I would go twice a year just to stock up on it. I want to tell you that doTERRA is a better than anything, including this Sensi, whatever it was from Japan that I used and I will never switch. I never, you know what? The other day I was looking at something and it popped up on my feed and I was like, oh, this looks really cool. And I'm like, I would, no way would I buy that stuff. No way would I spend $75, dollars on a skincare cream when I, that used to wouldn't even make me bad an eye. And our, our moisturizer is $34 before getting my 30% back in points <laughs> before I can use free points to buy it with and get it free now. So yeah, I'm never going back. Never. I love my doTERRA. All right, here, let's talk about some vitamins. Sherry. Just, what call, about- 
Yeah, just call me the vitamin queen. I used to have a bag that I took everywhere with me. I took it to work with me every day. I took it to church with me. I took it, it was with me in my car if I went shopping and it was full of medicine. But guess what it's full of now? It's full of doTERRA supplements and it's, it's full of goodness. It's just full of goodness. And so I don't look at it like, oh my gosh, I'm taking this many vitamins. No, I'm like, I mean, this is, this is, these have vegetables in them. These have plants and they have oils. They have fruits and vegetables and oils in these. So I'm just like putting nutrition in my body. Yeah. 12 servings of fruit and vegetables in here. And that is the tip of the iceberg for what you're getting. Cause there are some things they're getting in the lifelong vitality vitamins that you could not even purchase uh, at the grocery store because our soil is so depleted. Um, talk about let's talk about the the poison in our soil um there are even nanotechnologies in things like um chewing gum um some of the things like little debbie cakes and little donuts have nanotechnology in them now um it's just all coming out so you're going to start seeing that more and more we have gmos um where they're now boldly advertising that things are genetically modified foods like it's something to be proud of. Um, that impossible burgers that you see at all the restaurants now, uh, and they tout those as a um, health food, those are straight poison, okay? Those are some of the worst things you can put in your body. And we, our, our society, our culture is so ignorant that they can, they can literally make something that's poison and toxic to the human body, advertise it like it's a health food, and people will buy it. People will think it's cool to get a genetically modified food. Like, oh, well, that must be better for you. <laughs> right. Lord help us. Well, doTERRA has the best vitamins on the market. Our you know what it is? It's, it's Franken wheat. That's what it is. It's Franken wheat. It's because it's, it's not the wheat that our ancestors ate. Mm -mm, no. And our bodies don't even recognize it. So you're not gluten intolerant for those. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm chewing up one of these. <laughs> I need to drink water. <laughs> yeah, well, th those are really great because they have your C, D, zinc, and your On Guard oil in them. That just came out this year, and I, I'm just, I'm just loving that. It has everything you need in it. It does, it does. But I need to drink water. <clears throat> so anyway, those are amazing. And Franken food, the Franken food that you're talking about. Um, we are not gluten intolerant. We are intolerant of the poisons that are in the food that, the, that our culture, that our government is putting in there. Right. So yeah, um, some of my friends who are gluten intolerant and have celiac disease go overseas to Europe and say they can eat any kind of bread because mm -hmm. it's, uh, some of these countries that are more, more remote and don't have poison in their in their soil. Um, you can eat bread all day long. Doesn't make you gain weight. Doesn't make you bloated. Don't make you sick. This is shame. Anyway, don't get me started. <laughs> we already did <laughs> too late. Um, and then here's some of our cleaners. So we have a whole new cleaning line called abode. So you can get rid of your, um, your, we have laundry dishwashing pods. We have, um, uh, I'm sorry, dishwashing pods, laundry pods for your clothes. We also have an amazing spray cleaner that works like incredible. We have, um, you know, one of the things that is so bad for you are wipes, the Clorox wipes. So we have on guard wipes. So they're healing um, instead of causing all this disruption in your hormones and everything. And then we also have on guard in our toothpaste, in our mouthwash, instead of the fluoride, which lowers your IQ. <laughs> it's a neurotoxin. Fluoride is a neurotoxin and growing up. Right. So I went to the doctor dentist um, the other day for cleaning and they're like, um, I said, hey, make sure you're not giving me a fluoride treatment. Oh yeah, we have that note here on your charts. I'm like, I see you over there trying it. You're trying it. I don't want the fluoride. Okay. And the lady goes, well, what's the problem? She goes, we're just putting it on your tooth. It's not going in your skin. I'm like, 
excuse me, did you go to dental school? And she's like, yes. And I mean, I was saying it nice. I wasn't saying it mean. I was kind of laughing. And I said, you know, that the five, that putting something on your tooth is just like putting it in your brain. Like it is so absorbed into your skin. And I mean, it literally just goes right. It seeps right into your brain. It's the closest thing, these upper teeth to your brain. Are you kidding me right now? You want to put a neurotoxin on my fibrous tooth? And she's just like, <laughs> and then I had to kind of laugh, kind of like, I'm like, no. And she's like, oh, I never thought of it that way. What? And you are, this is what you do for a living? Anyway, again, don't get me started. So our toothpaste has frankincense. I mean, I'm sorry. It has myrrh. It has on guard. And um, it is so good for your teeth, so good for your immune system. And one of the things that the things that going around right now that starts with an O, um, it lives in your mouth and in your nasal cavity. So if you can keep your mouth really clean um, with the On Guard mouthwash and um, toothpaste, it really, really boost. It's an immune booster. So it's a boosting your immune system, killing germs in your mouth. And then if you have to wear a mask, please put on guard or breathe on the inside. It'll help you breathe better um, and help support your immunity as well. So amazing ditches and switches out with the old and in with the new. Hand sanitizer is also a hormone disruptor. So bad for us and our kids are using it like crazy and they may cause fertility issues later because of the hormone disruption that happens on the children. So we have the on guard spray that you can spray on your hands. That is healing. Um, I've had people stay at my house where they had like sores on their hands or a little rash on their hands. And they're like, hey, while well, I'm here, my hands are healed. Well, yeah, but you're using the on guard. Have you been washing your hands? Yes. Well, all my soap is on guard soap and all we use is the on guard spray. So it's healing for any kind of things that you might have on your hands too. And then we also have um, the hand wash and a pump that you can get. We have baby products. So we have, um, everybody knows about Johnson and Johnson with their um, lawsuits that uh, the toxins in the jo Johnson's baby powder, also the baby shampoo, all of those things are toxic and have been proven to be. And so doTERRA has a whole line of baby products and more cleaners, hand lotion, hand wash, all the things. And again, don't we wish we would have those when our kids were little, but now we know. So our grands get to get the benefit. Also the, the switch from candles to diffusers. You talked about that earlier, Sherry. What do you think? Is that an upgrade? Well, definitely an upgrade because also, I was I was a, a candle junkie. I loved candles. I wanted the best candles. I didn't like buy you know cheap ones. I bought expensive ones, and but they weren't the best. And I had them everywhere. I just felt like you know oh it's gonna make me feel better, but all along it was making me sick. When I began to read what I was breathing in. I was just like, I, I don't want to breathe that in. And I don't want my kids to breathe it in. And I sure don't want my grandkids to breathe them in. So I can't even, it's just like a memory. <laughs> yeah, it's a faint memory. Say goodbye. Um, we broke up, we broke up. <laughs> <laughs> we broke up with candles. Um, one of the leaders in doTERRA, um, she was a respiratory nurse, a registered nurse in respiratory. And uh, Sherry's heard this story, but um, she um, had a daughter who had respiratory issues. The daughter was in such bad shape that I think she's going to give her a lung transplant, a little young daughter, like maybe 10 years old. And when this woman as a respiratory specialist nurse, like the highest qualification you could be as a nurse, the, um, the degree and that she'd worked in ICU as a respiratory specialist for uh, at least a decade, found out that what was causing her daughter's distress was candles, the breeze and room sprays. And when she eliminated those from her house, her daughter started to get better. Um, but she's like, I was a heavy user of all those things. Um, her testimony is amazing. Her name's Lauren Bush and you can even find her on Facebook. So um, it's a real thing. Also, again, perfumes, doTERRA has perfume, but we make our own in a roller ball. We apply the beautiful rose or the jasmine or magnolia, whatever, neroli, orange blossom. She could smell like any of those things and layer them. And it's such a beautiful scent. And people always walk up to me and just like sniff and you smell so good. 
that's another thing I had to wean myself from. I literally had to wean myself because I love cologne uh, so much. Mm -hmm. And, but uh, now that's another thing I broke up with. Another thing that was in that big green garbage bag (laughs) (laughs) that I threw away. I hate to say it, but I do not miss them at all. I I still smell great with my my oils. I, I smell amazing as a matter of fact. Yeah. And my favorite oil, uh, favorite perfume I used was called peace. It was called scent of peace. And I spent, um, this large bottle, seven fifty. the small bottle was two fifty, and I would get it every year for my birthday and use it like all year. And when doTERRA came out with the peace, uh, scent, I was like, yes, I ordered it and I've never looked back. It is. That's what I love to wear peace. Okay, so here is our whole, um, if you want a beautiful line of cleaning products, ours are all refillable. You can buy those beautiful brown bottles one time and they're very inexpensive around 10, 11, $12. Buy them once uh, a piece and you buy them once and you just buy the refills over and over. So it's um, good for the planet, good for us and um, the best stuff I've ever used. Here are some kits that you can get started with. Now, up in the left corner is one called Aroma Essentials. That's $149.50. And these, I've, the way I have it stretched, it looks weird. But um, these are the five mil bottles. You get 10 of the best smelling essential oils and a diffuser. So if all you want to do is replace your candles and your scents and your room spray, sprays to get started with that, that's a great kit to start with. And whoever invited you to this class, if you want to say, hey, send me a link to the Aroma Essentials Kit, they'll get you in there, get you started, and you'll get a free membership with that as well um, this month, okay? Also, there's one called Healthy Start. If you want to replace your medicine cabinet, it's 10 oils and a diffuser. Uh, It's 160. That's the top right. Uh, If you want to start replacing um, things like your kind of go into a deeper dive with some of the supplements, there's the Cura collection. It's $249.50. And then if you want to start with one that has the vitamins, um, we have several new kits that are based around the vitamins. One is here called Healthy Habits. It's 195. So whoever invited you to this class, if that's when you're interested in, it has five oils, the deep blue and the supplements of the probiotic and um, the vitamins. Um, You can kind of see if you want to screenshot this right here and make a decision of what kit you'd like to get. Um, Some of you would like to maybe just like say, I want to start from scratch. I want to get rid of a lot of stuff in my house. I want to make a big transition. I'm ready to ditch and switch. A lot of the things that we talked about tonight, it's in the big kit called Natural Solutions. And that kit has even been reduced now. It's 485 and you get so much stuff. As a matter of fact, that second shelf there, I don't know if you can see it. It's just full of products. That's the Natural Solutions kit. You get that whole shelf full of stuff for 485. It's amazing. And that's a great way to start if you want to ditch and switch a lot of products. Again, if you want to order that and you want to get started with that, whoever invited you to this class, whether it's me or Sherry or anybody on this call, um, say, hey, send me a link for the natural solutions kit. They'll text you over a link and you can just click and fill out the form and you're in. And we will add you to our Facebook group. We will add you to our um, EO University, which is for where you get all the free education. Or if you're not on Facebook, we also have a place online where you can get your education. We have so many things for you. If you want to get started with these awesome essential oils, this is a great time to go through your house to detox. And if you want to know even more, yeah, text us, get a uh, slip in the, our DMs. If you're seeing this on Facebook, wherever you're seeing this, And we'll help you walk through your house and tell you where to transition. We can start with your health first, like Sherry did. Or if you want to start, like, I want to get rid of my candles. I want to get rid of lotions. I want to, yeah, wherever you want to start, we will help you a little bit at a time, make the transition into this beautiful life of health and healing where doTERRA is a one, uh, one stop shop where you get it delivered to your door, your shipping back in points, free stuff every month. And you join this amazing community of 
of women and men where we're helping you to be the healer in your home. So it's a whole lifestyle change. Uh, I want to say it's a lifestyle upgrade. What do you think about that, Sherry? Is that true? Because you're newer that, to this than I am. It's definitely an upgrade. Yeah, definitely an upgrade. It is. And, and we tell people about it and we can't stop because we love you. And when you have something that's changed your life and made you feel so, made you feel so much better, changed your family, empowered you to take your health back. We're not afraid of the stuff that's going around because we have mm -hmm. tools that help us stay healthy, build our immunity. And if something does happen where we get sick, we know exactly what to do to spring into action at the first sign of symptoms to treat the root cause and get to the root of it so that our body can heal itself. So if this sounds like something that's exciting to you, contact the person that you invited you to this class, text them right now and say, how can I get started? If you um, wanna ask them more questions, any of us, anybody on my team will be so glad to help you and assist you because we want you to be healed and whole. The Bible says, brethren, I would that you prosper and be in health, even as your soul prospers. And that is our, that is our prayer for you. So be blessed and stay healthy. And we'd love for you to join us. Shalom, shalom. Goodbye of all of you on Facebook. We're just going to tell you bye right now. Thank you. And we're going to stop the recording.